He yeah. clogs the toilet every single time. This is time. not going in the video. I'm, yes. I'm being Even his dad goes, I have never met somebody. Stop. I have never Stop. met what is up Marvel Squad? And welcome back to our channel. If you guys are new, my name is Raya. My name is Bill. We are doing 15 things guys do that girls hate. And I'm sure that annoy there's, the no, crap way. Out there's of us. no way that guys do more than 15 things wrong. Like guys are just like OG of the relationships. We're just gonna see that's one thing that annoys us. <laughs> kind of, oh just wait, sad. I'm not even gonna say what what it is, but there's something <laughs> on it that relates to that. But anyways, guys, just so you guys know, this isn't towards him. This is just guys in general. There's some things on here that you do yeah. that annoy the crap out of me, uh, but so this, other is, guys. this is just other general. Guys. You're this talking about other guys. I'm guys. giving them up why this isn't a towards you. So, so I don't if, even think if that half of them are towards me, then who are the other half towards? This is a, advice uh, for the were guys. You when you were making it's, these? Hmm? Hmm? This is advice. I'm on to you. Is he being a little dramatic? I'm on That's great that you're on to me. You. Anyways, guys, make sure to give this video a, a big, big thumbs, thumbs up. up. Comment down below when done. When done, because we give out two, two shout outs. outs every single video. Yes. Yes. I have a bunch of shout outs we have to give. I'm actually give out two right now. I'm gonna give out Ooh. two. What? Two. Yes. We're two. gonna change up the game. Two uh -huh. in the beginning. I'm gonna today. give out five. Okay. Just to one up you because you're just. All right, guys. So the first post notification shout out goes to Erica Lynn. Shout out to you, Erica. Shout out to you, Erica. We love you so much. And we do gotta give out, I'm gonna give out one more. And our next shout out goes to Itzel Chavez. So we shout love out to you. you. We are feeling very generous today. We're gonna give out two in the beginning and two I in guess the so. End. I guess you're breaking the rules. I yes, mean, because I, had a I'm trying to get to everyone. And now you're veering off the path. You went, you went, you know, into the dark forest. So now it's just, I'm it's trying. up for grabs. We don't know where this video is gonna end up. I'm, we can end up in, you know, a freaking different house. Anyways, guys, let's me. get on to this video before I am gonna strangle him before we can get to the rest of this. Oh my god, I strangled you last video, now you can strangle me this video. Okay. Alright, let's go. Uh, do that. You, have to, <laughs> you gotta put that, you gotta put that scene in where I go, eh. First thing that guys do that girls hate, when you're in the middle of a conversation, and he looks at his phone, or he interrupts you. And did you see in the beginning of the video how I was trying to talk and he interrupted me? <laughs> okay, that's just... That's towards you. That that's part just me having you. an idea and wanting to relate it to our Marvel Squad. That one was towards Bill a little bit because he wasn't. He does interrupt me a lot. I don't interrupt you a lot. I, I interrupt you But guys, a when you are in the middle of a conversation, <laughs> don't go on your phone and don't interrupt. Right. I, I love you. Like that. But that was hold sweet on, of hold you. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, don't do that. That is the thing that you should not do. Okay, well, maybe something just more interesting came up. All right, anyways, guys, number two. Dose. Dose. <laughs> <laughs> guys who look anywhere but in your direction when you're talking to them. Like, they'll be talking to them, and then they'll look away. They're looking at somebody else. Do not do that. When you are in a conversation with a girl, do not. Or a guy. I mean, you don't have to have, I think it's very awkward if you have direct eye contact. It's like Not if you love them. If you love them, you don't care. Like, you don't want to be like this. Come here. Do I not look at you? Yeah, but we don't, like, stare into each other's souls when we're talking. Guys, we have to be aware of our surroundings, okay? We are the people that wear the pants in the relationship. So if Give anyone, advice to the guy. Listen, Stop. if I'm outside at a restaurant, whatever, you know, and all of a sudden the car, I see a car coming. It's out of control. <sighs> guy the hero pulls you out of the way because i was looking at the other way oh, so mean. if i just stared you in the eye we'd be dead bill is a meme so make sure you tunnel in on them and don't break eye contact no matter what no matter if someone's choking on okay food, cut it does not matter because your girlfriend is the only thing that matters and her eyes to yours oh my god that's what you were saying third thing that girls hate in guys guys who smell like they gave up the concept of not showering guys who think that they don't stink so if you gave up the concept of not showering that means you would shower no guys who smell like they gave up the concept of not showering they gave oh, up the concept of not getting in the shower yes they gave up the concept of not basically showering. guys the concept of not showering sh it's unattractive they gave it up okay, so they do shower anyways guys it is unattractive when a guy is stinky. <laughs> like, he came to my house the other day and Hard he work. raked up a storm. Hard work. Didn't I'm shower, and I'm like, babe, I'm sorry, but you raking. There's reasons for everything. But, anyways, guys, just make sure you shower. Don't, yeah, make sure you don't, don't go stink. to your girl's house with sweaty armpits and BO. Make sure you put the deodorant on and some cologne and just make sure you smell yeah. tidy. Okay, fourth thing that 
guys do that girls hate is long, dirty nails. I think it's unattractive if a guy what? has long nails. Long, dirty nails. Yeah, like coming from the shop and you have dirt all under your nails. It's just that. like, they're, they're good. on point right now. But just. Mostly because I picked it all out. Guys, if you're a guy, do not grow your nails that long. It just does not look right. <laughs> the only time I like it when you do this because when you scratch like my back and my arm because I love that. Yeah. Better than that. Wow. Clip those things. Ugh. Fifth thing. When they don't notice something new, like your hair, your nails, <laughs> if you had a really good makeup oh, day and you I changed it you guys, up. I literally, I've done this too many times, honestly, I know, where every single time I come over, when I'm hugging you, I'm like, okay, did she get anything done? Do I have to tell her anything? This think, is a daily occurrence. I think that's really annoying. Let's see if he notices and they don't notice. I'm like, really, babe? Yeah, come I'm on. Sure, I'm sure this is a worldwide problem we're going to have to deal with. Yeah. yeah. Six thing is when they call us girls crazy. Okay, listen. <laughs> You're crazy. Us girls. You're crazy for saying that. We're crazy in our own way. But that does not mean. So you're crazy. That, psh, I'm talking. <laughs> that does not mean you guys are not crazy. If you guys have a crazy side too, you guys oh, here's get the a thing. little nuts. Here's the thing. I want to tell you guys something. Girls, they go cuckoo when you call them crazy, right? But they don't know that they could call you crazy. What, like, what's stopping them? They literally. Because we don't. Why would we call you that? Why would That's I call you that? You do something and you're like, you're crazy. Exactly. You're crazy. Okay, why don't you turn that around on me and be like, you know what? You're crazy. And I'll be like. Okay. Anyways, I hate when guys say that okay. because they some guys are like, oh my gosh, she was so crazy. It's like, get over it. Everybody's <laughs> crazy in their own way. You yeah. gotta learn how to tolerate them. You clearly don't want to be in a relationship you can't deal with your significant other when they go a little bit, you know, cuckoo. Yeah. Cause, when they go off the rails. Yeah. Seventh thing is playing video games. They pick video games over hanging out with you. And I'm gonna say this. When me and him first started dating, don't speak. <laughs> me and him first started dating, he was a little bit crazy with video games. Crazy. See, I don't care that you called me crazy. I wasn't Whatever. calling you crazy. I was calling you crazy to, when you were playing video games. Like I still, crazy I, I wouldn't care. In video games. I would, I'm not going to go crazy. Anyways, crazy. sometimes he would make up a lie saying, oh, you know, I'm really tired. I want to go to bed. And go play video games. And then he goes play video games. So he would basically <laughs> want me to uh, leave this early. Is a, this is also a... Uh, He'd big, want me to leave early. Just play video games. Now, he does not play video games anymore, so yeah. that's great. So, but he did choose video games over me a lot the of the point, time. The point is, gentlemen, if you're playing video games, don't get caught like I did because then she's just going to keep bringing it up and up and up. So if I you are playing video games and you're, you know... You're I don't like, care if he plays video games, but it's like, don't kick me out. What, what about I hung out with you and played video games at the same time? That's different. Okay, so... But you were used, to, you used to choose video games over me all the time. I never did. Anyways, number eight is being too clingy. Listen, I love clingy. Apparently not, you wrote it down. No, I no, I don't. I'm gonna explain. <laughs> I like it in certain things, but sometimes you're clingy to the point where I'm like, babe, okay, get off me, and you wanna still stay on me. Yeah, I'm and I'm like getting, I'm like suffocating because- it, How am I, I'm not too clingy. No. I, I'm not too clingy. We're both clingy for each other, but yeah. there's sometimes to a point I don't where- think I, I don't think I'm really He doesn't respect all. me, not respect, but he doesn't like, listen when I say get off of me. Yeah. Like right now, I look at him, he's strangling me while we're trying to film a video. I'm not clingy, I'm just, I just, I'm, I, I love you. Okay, you're hurting me. What? I think being too clingy is better than not being clingy No, and I agree, I like- Because it. what about- I like that you're all over me and you give me attention, but sometimes- What about I came sometimes here- Sometimes when I'm not in a like, mood, when I'm not in the mood, you want to just be all on me, and I'm like, just give me my space. That's what I mean by being too clingy. Oh, okay. Learn. Number nine. Guys who are cocky and think they are better than everyone else. Oh my <laughs> you god. Know that's for me. Look at my new car. Oh, you're gonna say nails. The new like, upgrades. You know, like <laughs> I'm the next big hot shot mods. on the football team, and oh, I am just geez. the right. popular one. Right, 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 girl. You got a lot to learn. Okay. Uh, First of all, guys do not talk like that. Yes. All, a lot of guys are cocky, and they'll like when you were ever in gym class, and like you would play a certain game, they would literally tackle you because they don't. They just don't care. Oh, yeah. Like I had guys in my swim class spray water at me. Oh yeah, we used to do belly flops right next to where the girls were sitting. Yeah, you guys are too and cocky just to, just to get them, cause like, they don't want to get their hair wet. So no, we just, like, you know, I'm such a badass. I have a six pack. I don't need you. Like, I'm, the guys I'm that... a badass. Look at my six pack. <laughs> uh. 10. Guys that can't spell correctly. 
you. <laughs> me. We will post them on our YouTube. I don't think this is targeting me. This is this is targeting one. I don't think it is. I have pretty good grammar. No, I have to literally go over and check the videos to make sure there's no grammar errors. You've done that a lot of times. You you put it in a well, thumbnail. You that's put why you gotta title, get a second like, second no. opinion. Because like I'm up all night editing, uh, and then boom, one word's wrong. All hell breaks loose. Number eleven, guys. Getting mad that we have our periods and are <laughs> 10 times more annoying to us and can't seem to understand why we are moody and have a short temper. You know, every girl who has a boyfriend oh knows God. that when you, really when you are on your period, they seem to want to tick you off more than you were <laughs> already you're are. Just, maybe you're just But feeling, we're very hormonal. Maybe I'm just acting the same way I am. It's just since you're on your period, you're a little more pushy. So if I go you like You should that, know what on my period not to be like all like you know, I, uh, I don't know why, but like, guys, I feel like any time your girlfriend's on her period, I, f I literally feel like we act he always messes with worse. Them. I feel like we mess with them more oh just because, God. like, it's not even cool. I don't, I don't know why. We just do it. Like, so annoying, guys. I love you. Good thing you're not on your period right now. Number 12, not having any sort of style. I like sweatpants and all that stuff. But That's the nighttime. It, no, it can be in the daytime too, but if you're always like, you, you're wearing some ugly yeah. clothes every day and you just look like a slob yeah. i think it's kind of unattractive because it doesn't look like you care about Guys, yourself clean yourself up i'll take a shower put on some nice clothes you know get a nice and throw over whatever. make yourself look nice some sometimes. some nice ripped jeans you go for the bad boy style you go for the innocent style there's so many different styles you just gotta pick yours yeah. but just don't look like you know you just crawl out of a sewer yeah number 13 when they fart too much oh my god this <laughs> kid Farts like there's no Kid, tomorrow. Man, and it stinks. first of all, correction, this man. And guys, I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna I'm roasting guys, him right now. Guys are human. I will never meet somebody who clogs a toilet every single time they go number two. Not putting that Ask in. Bill's family. Not putting this in. They he clogs I'm up not the putting toilet. This in the video. This is not going in the video. He clogs the toilet every single this time. This is not going in the video. I'm yes. I'm totally being Even his dad you. goes, I have never met somebody. Out. Stop. I have never Stop. met somebody is, oh, who clogs a toilet as much as Billy. What are you even Billy. talking about? Do you know like what you're talking about? Yeah, your family. She's talking. Your she's mom and talking dad that's watching butt. this, they know exactly what I'm talking about. She's talking about. out of her butt right now. Number 14. Always being late to things. Like mostly important things. Like Just being late in general. Just being late in general. I just think it's unattractive because like. Why do, why do you have to time. classify everything as unattractive? Why can't it just be like. I don't think it's, it's annoying. It's annoying and it's unattractive to me. Like be on time. If it's a special occasion. I'm not going to wait 10 minutes for you. Because you're. I don't know what you do. Like Bro, what do you okay, do? What, what do you guys do? do? What are you going to do? Just leave? Just going to leave and go there? Without me? No it's embarrassing. Because I don't, I don't like late. being late. Well, what about I'm in the middle of something like paying taxes, you know, or you know, the, see, the, skinning a deer. See, that doesn't happen. It, it could. No, I just don't like it. There's a reason are late. behind everything. No, I don't like people who are late. The final and last one, this number is the 15. The last one on the list. I've made it this far. Think I could go one more, depending on what it is, because if it's just whack, not not responding to it. Okay, at all. guys. This better be good for your last one. Did you make this good? Yes, because it's, it's real. And it's real. Well, yeah. these all are real, apparently. I even all right, guys. They thinking they are always right oh. about every argument or situation. We're just going to end the video right here because guys are all always right. All right, I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Until then, you know, peace. See, that's so, una <laughs> see, that's so unattractive. What? And annoying. What? That you can't... You guys think that, oh, I'm right, you know, like, any statistics, I'm right. I am right. No. I am right. So irritating, guys. Okay. Anybody who knows that. Guys. You're not always right, all, and I'm not always we right. We all know that, guys, you know, we, we're right, you know, most uh, sometimes, but if you think you're right, and she doesn't think you're right, then just keep it in your head. You know you're right, she doesn't, whatever. Girls are always right. Yeah, I'm right, you know. I'm oh, right. Like, girls are always right. Bye. No, you can't just leave. Come back. You can't just leave. That. I'm right. And. The 15 things that guys do. <laughs> she had to read the title. She forgot. That guys do that girls hate. <laughs> For the record, all this is an opinion. Okay, this is your opinion. Maybe other girls' opinions. Okay, because I don't think that you know some of that stuff should be on there. Because like you know. <laughs> this is right. I'm no, right. I'm, I'm my video. It's just how I feel. Right. It's how I feel and what attracts <laughs> me and what doesn't. And what you spent a long me. time thinking about that, didn't you? writing down that list. I hope you all enjoyed this video as much as she did. Can't really say for myself, but 
you know, if you think she's right, then go comment down that she's right. If you think that there's some things in there that need to be tweaked a little bit, you know, go down in the comments and tell us what needs to be tweaked. No. So we're gonna give the end of the video post, post notification, notification shout out. out. And that goes to Kaylee Gillespie. She Gillespie. said, please give me a shout out. I've been waiting for months. Also, my fan account is Mariah.nd.bill. I've seen your fan account. We love it. Love your content. Thank you for supporting us. And we're gonna give one more too. Thank you so much. We're giving another one? Four, four shout outs. I said two in the beginning, two that is the four, end. For some YouTubers, that is four videos and we're getting into one. This makes me sad, guys. Shout out to Joff Karen. She says, when you realize your idols will never give you a shout out, but no matter what, I will always watch your videos. Love you guys. So shout out to you, we love you. Yeah, we love and, you too. Uh, we're getting through, we're getting through. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up mm. for Team Mariah. No, what? what? Yeah. When did Team Mariah come into this Mariah. equation? And make Can sure- Can we give a big thumbs up for Team Bill no. and Team Mariah, okay. even though Bill is Team Marble. Mariah. Team Marble. Yeah, or you can pick in between Team Marble. And make sure you subscribe to the greatest squad here on YouTube. Yes. Because mm -hmm. we have big things in the world. coming. We have big in the things. galaxy. Yeah, we have big yeah. things coming. Big things. Giant things. Giant things, yeah. So we will see you guys in the next video. But until then. But until then. Peace. peace.